In the future, family members who are far away from each other may no longer cross half of the world to meet, through 6G will allow them to feel the temperature of hugs and handshakes, sitting at home can also walk the Maldives beach, feel the sand slipping between fingers and the refreshing sea breeze. These scenes will not only appear in science fiction movies, it will come to our lives in the near future. Can you believe it? Well, on June 21, China Mobile, one of China's three major communication giants, released the China Mobile 6G Network Architecture Technology White Paper and stated that the next three to five years will enter a strategic window period for 6G network development, and 6G is expected to be commercially available around 2030. In fact, this is not just China's opinion. During the World Economic Forum in Davos, Switzerland, Nokia CEO Pekka Lundmark said during a panel discussion that 6G is expected to be commercially available around 2030. At present, many manufacturers around the world are developing related technologies, and it is also expected that 6G will be commercialized around 2030. In fact, the commercial use of 6G around 2030 is basically in line with the expectation of a new generation of global mobile communications in an average of about 10 years. So, since the first year of 5G commercial use in 2019, how has the global promotion of 5G technology been? Can 6G really be commercialized in eight years? At present, which country has the most advanced 6G construction? What changes can 6G bring to our lives? Hi! Welcome to TechTeller. Before we start today's video, please subscribe to our channel, which is the encouragement that we can create more videos. Okay, let's move on to today's topic. First of all, let's take a look at the current promotion effect of 5G technology in the world. At present, global 5G users will cross the 1 billion mark this year. In its semi-annual report, Ericsson pointed out that thanks to high usage rates in China and North America, global 5G users are expected to cross the 1 billion mark this year. By 2027, global 5G users may reach 4.4 billion people. And what about the 5G performance in China? According to data, the number of 5G base stations in China has increased from 130,000 at the end of 2019 to 1.615 million in April 2022, which occupy more than 60% of the world, and it is expected that the number of 5G base stations will exceed 2 million by the end of 2022. As of the end of April 2022, the number of 5G mobile users reached 413 million, accounting for 24.8%. After learning about the popularity of 5G, let's take a look at the global 6G technology. Which one is the strongest? As early as 2018, China has already started to study 6G technology. As of September 2021, China ranks first in the world with a 40.3% share of 6G patent applications. Next, let's take a look at the 6G development status of Chinese companies. The 5G technology leader, Huawei, has already started the research and development of 6G. Previously, Huawei's expert disclosed 6G-related progress, saying that Huawei 6G is in the stage of scene mining and technology search, and Huawei believes that the future 6G network will be dominated by millimeter waves. Now, let's take a look at the situation of the three major operators in China. China Mobile announced its entry into 6G after obtaining the 5G license, and will conduct scientific research in various aspects such as 6G communication network and next-generation internet technology together with Tsinghua University. China Telecom has put forward the vision of 6G network architecture, and it has also entered a key stage of 6G research, such as the distributed 6G network architecture of PIN's near-area network, and the 5G-A divided by 6G system integrating satellite communication. It is expected that the business needs of 6G, index requirements, key technologies, etc. will be launched around 2023 to 2025. China Unicom also launched research on 6G as early as 2019 and released a white paper. Not only that, China Unicom has also signed a 6G strategic cooperation agreement with ZTE Corporation. In addition to China, the United States, Japan, South Korea, India, etc. are also actively deploying 6G. 
Among them, the United States is currently leading in 6G space resources, Japan and South Korea have certain advantages in key technologies such as orbital angular momentum technology, satellite technology, and high-altitude platform communication for 6G communications. So, can 6G really be commercialized in 2030? Judging from the current situation, the development context of 6G is gradually becoming clear. Various countries are stepping up research and development. By increasing capital investment in scientific research projects and other measures to accelerate the research and development of 6G innovative technology, the competition has also entered a state of white-hot. It is concluded that 6G will start the corresponding standardization work around 2025 and will be commercialized around 2030. For reference, China started research on 5G technology in 2013 and officially commercialized it in 2019. It took less than 10 years to realize the commercial use of 5G, while the research on 6G has been started in 2018, and it has been three years now. There are still eight years to 2030, and we have reason to believe that 6G will be commercially available in 2030 or earlier. You may ask, after the commercial use of 6G, what changes will it bring to our lives? At present, the 6G network will be a fully connected world integrating terrestrial wireless and satellite communications, which will mainly promote the development of the Internet. And with the linkage support of the Global Satellite Positioning System, the Telecommunication Satellite System, the Earth Image Satellite System and the 6G Ground Network, the Ground Air Full Coverage Network can also help humans predict the weather and quickly respond to natural disasters. Experts said, there are many visions and potential technologies for 6G, and the current one-year network flow will be daily flow in the 6G era. For future application scenarios, experts believe that the application of 6G will far exceed the scope of communication. 6G will comprehensively improve peak speed, latency, mobility, and positioning capabilities, far superior to 5G. In terms of speed, the 6G network will be 100 times faster than 5G, with almost a terabyte per second, which means we can download a movie in a blink of an eye, and driverless cars will be very easy to operate without any delay. In addition to further promoting the three major 5G scenarios of enhanced broadband, high reliability and low latency communication, and massive machine interconnection to maturity, 6G will also add two new application scenarios of artificial intelligence and perception. In addition, 6G will also contribute to environmental protection and help various industries around the world achieve the dual carbon goals. In addition, 6G is expected to evolve into a platform for the connection of all things. Through this platform, the mobile network can connect a large number of smart devices, realize the deep integration of the real physical world and the virtual digital world, and the magical metaverse will further become possible, creating a new world that connects and perceives all things. In short, the transition from academic research to industrial vision of 6G is a process that takes time to settle, and its development is currently in a critical period, requiring the joint efforts of all parties. Although the development will face many innovation challenges, we are all looking forward to the day when 6G is truly commercialized. Okay, that's all for today. Please put your comments below and share your insightful ideas. Please keep following our channel and like our videos. I am Tech Teller, the person to tell you the opinions that worth spreading every day. Thank you so much for your continuous support. Your precious time with us is highly appreciated. See you.